What's up guys? Today I'll be reviewing a fragrance set I purchased from the Parfums de Marly website called the Masculine Discovery Set. Now I am getting into fragrances, so I thought this would be a good idea to purchase a set of sample fragrances from the Parfums de Marly website. I thought this would be a good idea since it contains seven of their most popular fragrances for only $48. And it also has a redeemable coupon towards purchasing their full size fragrance bottles. Today I'll be doing a quick review of each fragrance in this set. And keep in mind, I am just getting into fragrances, so my subjective uh, review of each one will be based on my own experience. Hope you enjoy. Now the fragrance comes in this packaging, which I thought was very nice and tasteful. Uh, it has this packaging, which is, you know, different from the normal packaging you get. So I thought this was really nice in presentation wise in the delivery of the product. You can take a look at the box itself and it's quite luxurious looking even for a sample box. It comes in this black matte uh, paper and the, the text and the logo are all silver printed. As we slide it open, it contains all the fragrances that are in this package. The Greenlee, Sedley, Percival, Leighton, Carlisle, Pegasus, and Harold. And here are all the samples. What I do also like about these uh, sample sprayers at the, is that the sprayers work fairly well for sample sprayers. There are some sample sprayers that don't spray very well, but these are actually pretty nice. And as you can see, very, even for a sample set, looks very luxurious and nice. Now the first fragrance is Greenlee. And what I got from this fragrance is a fresh citrus woody, spicy apple opening. And this is a very fresh fragrance. It smells like I'm walking through the woods. This is a daytime fragrance, hence the name. And it gives you a spring and summer vibe and it's very fresh. The website describes this fragrance as reflective of pure energy and a fresh breath of spring, a joyful whirlwind of fruit citrus bark and sap which flows into a crisp tangy green apple surprise so this is a very fresh fragrance it smells really good it smells like i'm walking through the woods and through nature this is the green leaf the next fragrance is the sedley this is another fresh fragrance and i picked up citrus a green herbal and woody and musky uh, scent when I when I sprayed this on, and this really reminds me of a sunny day, and it's a really good fresh uh, fragrance to wear during the daytime. Uh, according to the Parfums de Marly website, it is described as light, forceful, and fresh, watery with aerial scents. This is a fragrance which gives you a sense of being at the beach on a sunny day with aquatic uh, notes. Uh, to me, it is very much a daytime fragrance. It reminds me of being outside on a sunny day uh, or in a really grassy area. So it has this fresh 
uh, really fresh daytime fragrance. Um, the Parfums de Marly website recommends this to be worn during the spring and summer for a day at the sea. The next scent is the Percival. Now, this scent immediately, uh, to me, smells really good. This is an uh, instant like when I sprayed it on. It smells like a familiar men's fragrance in a good way and not in a generic way. It is aromatic, sweet, floral, citrusy, musk, musky, fresh, aquatic, and woody. This is something that I could wear on a daily basis. It's easy to wear. It's very attractable and likable. This is uh, one fragrance out of this sample set that um, I would like to own in the future someday. Uh, Parfums de Marly describes this as a fresh, sensual, and refined scent. It is a daytime scent, but it can be worn in the nighttime as well. Uh, they recommend this being worn during the spring, summer, and fall. And I think this is a very versatile scent. Definitely check this one out. Next is the Parfums de Marly Layton. This is a very popular fragrance from Parfums de Marly. To me, it smells super good upon spring. It's a beautiful smelling fragrance. It's very fresh, sweet, woody, ambery, and spicy. Described as a amber floral fragrance. It has a freshness, a spiciness, aromatic, floral notes, and woody notes. I would also say that this is one of my favorites and I would like to own this uh, bottle one day. This is an instant like and it has a very luxurious smell to it. When I first smelled this, I did not know that you can bottle uh, the scent of luxury, but this scent embodies luxury uh, in this fragrance. Uh, the best time to wear this fragrance, according to their website, is all day long, especially in the colder months. It is described as distinguished and addictive with vanilla, precious woods, and an intriguing note of caramelized coffee. It captures the essence of Devonier, which is a stylish and confident, charming individual. This is the Layton by Parfums de Marly. Next is the Carlisle. This is a aromatic, floral, sweet, and herbal fragrance. It, the opening has these uh, characteristics, and once it dries down, it has a spice, spiciness, powderiness, and woodiness. Uh, to me, it's a very sharp fragrance. It smells like I'm walking through an herb garden, and to me, it's pretty good. It has an earthy, earthly smell to it, and some people say it smells like tobacco. According to their website, the Carlisle is the embodiment of light, sunny, radiant, built around sandalwood, warm, some vanilla, soothing, and rich. This one also has a rich and luxurious smell to it. This is uh, more of a cold weather fragrance. All right, the next scent is Pegasus. Now, Pegasus is a very unique smelling fragrance. Uh, this is a unisex fragrance, and there are, uh, I forgot to mention that there are a couple other fragrances in this masculine discovery line that are actually unisex. But this is also a unisex fragrance, can be more, uh, worn by men and women. And I like this fragrance very much, um, so much that I actually purchased uh, the actual bottle on sale because of its availability. So I purchased this um, 
on a on a sale website and as you can see it has this really nice uh, silver reflective mirror finish and uh, super heavy feels like it's one pound and um, so we'll do a quick review of this Pegasus to me personally I know it's not in the lineup of notes but to me it smells like root beer in a good way because I enjoy root beer growing up so it has this kind of sweet uh, root beer scent for me don't know why but it is a sweet fresh uh, fragrance it's very unique smelling it has almond vanilla lavender floral notes and a powderiness to it to me it's a very good and comforting smell and it is considered a gourmand gourmand fragrance um, according to the parfums de marley website it's fit for a gentleman it's woody an exceptionally distinguished signature smell opens with a balance of fruit wood and spice it's uh, its heart notes are beautifully intertwined combination of jasmine lavender bitter almond creating a powdery fresh fragrance and the base lingers on the skin with vanilla infused with oriental twist of amber and sandalwood this fragrance is recommended for the spring fall and winter day and night lastly we got the herald this is a very strong fragrance for me. It's woody, spicy, um, herbaceous, and it has a tobacco note in it. And it's very distinct and strong. And for me, I'm not used to tobacco, so this, this one hit me kind of weird. But people do like tobacco leaf in their fragrance. So if you like tobacco, definitely check this one out. Uh, it's a very unique smelling fragrance, uh, but the dry down for me actually smells a lot better. Uh, the opening was pretty intense, but on the dry down, the vanilla comes through, making uh, the fragrance smell very smooth. Uh, according to the Parfums de Marly website, it's personified by a smoky vanilla scent, spicy top of cinnamon and pepper, uh, the heart is tobacco leaf um, and something called osmanthus. The pepper notes are surrounded by vanilla, musk, patchouli, and woody accords at the base. This is very elegant and discernible. They describe it as a the epitome of old world sophistication. It's kind of weird. I kind of picture someone smoking a pipe in a library in an old school, uh, old school setting. So this is what I kind of picture in my mind when I smell this fragrance. It's good as a night, a night scent in the fall and winter, and it lasts really long on my skin. Now that will do it for this review of the Parfums de Marly Masculine Discovery Set. I really enjoyed this discovery set because the scents and fragrances in this set are very luxurious, really refined. Um, I really enjoyed smelling each and every one of these samples. And for my personal favorites would be the Percival, the Layton, and the Pegasus. So perhaps I would make these purchases of the, of the actual bottles themselves in the future. If you guys like this video, please like and subscribe. Let me know what you guys uh, would like to see or recommend in the comments below. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.